Depiction Software's unparalleled understanding of the decorative concrete industry comes from over 12 years of experience in helping companies like Supercrete, Concrete Solutions, Stardeck, Golden Look, Artcrete, and CTI to name a few to improve their concrete sales by creating software that helps the dealers and contractors close more sales. DecoCon Imaging Software allows you to take a picture of your client's project, whether it be a driveway, walkway, patio, commercial or residential area, and then show them what different colors and patterns of decorative concrete would look like on those areas of that project. So now they can actually see what it's going to look like before you do any work. As you know, when a customer can see how great their home is going to look with your products on it, they are sold instantly. The program not only does stamped and stenciled concrete for driveways and patios, but you can also do acid stains on interior floors and even countertops. You can also do epoxy stone, and epoxy flakes for garage floors. Our contractors know the presentation value of an actual photograph depicting the planned decorative concrete project is tremendous. It's a surefire way to close the deal faster. Many contractors have reported a closure rate of 85 to 90 percent when showing an image completed with DecoCon. Don't take our word for it. Check out our testimonial page online to hear what our customers have to say. Now you may be telling yourself, it all sounds great, but will I be able to use the program because I'm not very computer savvy? Well, first of all, the program is designed for ease of use, and there are training movies and tutorials that show you every step of the way, so there are no manuals to read. And if you do ever get stuck, we have free tech support. So let me take a few minutes to show you just how easy it is to use. You start your imaging project by opening up a picture that you've taken with your digital camera or smartphone. By going to the open image icon and navigating to the folder where you saved it on your hard drive. Then double click the image to bring it to the screen. The next step is to clean up the image. Sometimes there are things you want to remove from the picture. In this case, it's the basketball hoop in the driveway. To remove it, we're going to use the clone tool. The clone tool has square and round brushes in many sizes. We'll pick a large square brush from the pull down list. Then right click where you want to grab the texture from the house and then left click and drag it to the left so that you're taking the texture from the right and moving it across the basketball hoop to remove it. And repeat the process as we go down the pole. And like magic, it's gone. Now we're ready to draw on the image where we want to place the decorative concrete. We'll select the drawing tool and trace the existing driveway. You click down to set the first point. Then move your mouse to the next point and click. You repeat this process until you get to the end and then you double click to close the polygon. Now I did a sloppy job here at the bottom of the driveway to show you how flexible the drawing tool is. You can add points to any line and then move that point to be as accurate as you want to be. When you are done drawing, you would click on the Pattern Library button to bring you to this Pattern Library menu. The program comes with over 24,000 images of decorative concrete that appear in the library window here on the right. You can sort through this library by using the sorting menu. For example, you can sort by manufacturer. You see the library has changed to different products. You can also sort by color so that you can see all the patterns available in that color. Or you can sort by pattern. When I select it on basket weave, now I see all the colors available in the basket weave pattern. You can also sort by product type like acid stain, paint chips, spray texture, or stamped concrete. 
or multiple combinations. Now I see stamped concrete in the basket weave pattern only. You can scroll through the thumbnail library to view all the stamped basket weave colors. When you find the color you want, just click on it and it's placed in the defined area you drew over the driveway. To change the perspective of the bricks to make it look more realistic, click on the perspective handles and then drag them to the edge of the driveway and you can see how the bricks look like they have turned. Then grab the other side and line up the edges also. You can adjust the scale of the brick by dragging the scale slider to the right which makes them larger and to the left which makes them smaller. This allows you to get the exact size you want. Once you get the perspective and scale set, you can try out different colors to see what looks best with this home. I think the gray color would look much better. You can also try out a completely different pattern and look in a matter of seconds by selecting a new pattern and picking the color that you want. Now I want to place borders on the edges of the driveway. To do this, I'll use the drawing tools and I'll draw the borders here on the right and then on the left. Then I'll select on the pattern library shortcut. I'll select on patterns and scroll down till I get to soldier course pattern. Then I'll select the gray pattern here and do a quick adjustment of the perspective on the sides. And again once you have the perspective set you could try out a different color combination in a matter of seconds. Or you could change the border to a solid textured trowel finish for a completely different look. Now let's try a darker color to see what that will look like. I'm satisfied so I'll click OK to exit the menu. Now let's add a stamped concrete cobble circle pattern to the middle of this driveway. To do that we open up the object library for cobble circles. Then we click on the color we want to try out and it pops up on the screen. Now of course this is too large and not at the right angle for the driveway. So we'll click on the warp tool and adjust the perspective to make it look like it's laying down on the driveway. Once you have the perspective set, you can try out different color combinations by clicking and dragging them from the library and just dropping them onto the existing circle. Or you could try out a stenciled star compass by using the same technique and see the changes instantly. DecoCut also gives you the ability to take a plain graphic image or a design template and fill them with acid stains, paint chips, knockdown or trial finish. We have pulled the compass from the template library and then click on the fill wand command for this process. Then open the Century Stone Trial Textures and pick Charcoal from the library. Scale it down and then I will just click on each section of the design and it is filled with that texture. Then select a different color and fill in the accent lines. So now that I'm done, I want to save my new compass with this color combination so that I could use it again in the future. So I click on File, Export, I'm going to name it Star, then click Save, and delete it from the screen. Now I want to add it to my library of templates. So I select Add Items, now I've added it to the library, and I'll just click and drag it onto the compass, and it replaces it. Now basically this design is done, but you may want to add some extra information to this image. The program will automatically label the products that you've placed in the image. Let's label what's placed in the driveway. So we'll click on the driveway and go to the pattern library icon. If you look here on the menu, you'll notice that the program calls out the manufacturer, the color, product, and pattern. Simply click on the stamp it button and the text is placed on the screen. This text can be moved and edited by right clicking. We'll take out the manufacturer name 
and change the font to a larger size. Now we need to open up this window to display the larger size. Now if you have a logo or a graphic you'd like to place in the image, you can open that file, then size it down and place it on the screen. You may also want to place the before image in the upper right hand corner of the screen by using the same technique as the logo. I would like to place the word before over the before image. So I go to add text, type it in, and then move it into place. Now at this point you could save this image and print it out or you could email it directly to the customer from within the program. There is a command called send JPEG email. It will automatically convert the file to a JPEG and attach it to an email program like Outlook. You fill out the text you want and then press send. It's that easy. All the images in the program can be saved as a work in progress file type, which means they can be pulled up at a later date and changes are easily made. So let's show you how that works. Let's say you gave a customer a proposal. And a month later he calls up and says, my wife wants to see what the job would look like in a different color scheme. So you open up the file that you saved as a work in progress. And instead of the gray color scheme that you propose, she wants to see the same design, but only with a reddish brown and tan combination. So all you have to do is pull up the texture libraries and then just drag and drop the new colors on the surfaces. And as you can see, within a minute, you have a whole new color scheme to email them. The program is not limited to flat surfaces on the ground. You can also use it for vertical surfaces like walls and stone veneer. Make sure you check out our website at decorativeconcretesoftware.com where you can find more information and view samples of all the colors from each manufacturer. You can also view the stamped patterns, stencil patterns, acid stains, epoxy stone, and epoxy flakes, all available in the program. You may also want to view images in the gallery. Keep in mind all these images were created with the program. And while you're there, you may want to check out our award-winning estimator program for decorative concrete overlay. So get a jump on your competition now by showing your decorative concrete ideas in full color. And increase your closing ratio like thousands of our satisfied customers have reported over the years. So give us a call today at 817-764-0413 and talk to our experienced sales staff.